talking about with collecting the blood. You can scrape it and then scoop it up in there and put it in. Um, I'm very shocked that Cookie Monster was murdered because he's so innocent and all he does is like to eat cookies. So I don't really get why someone would want to kill him, but we're trying to figure out the reason why. So we think that the person or animal came in, tied him up, duct taped his mouth, stabbed him in the head with a knife, and then stabbed him somewhere in his stomach or chest and then tortured him. Our victim today is the cookie monster and the girls are processing the crime scene. Throughout the week they have learned how to analyze fingerprints, uh, hair analysis and blood spatter. All of that evidence is here. They are collecting it now and going to analyze to see which suspect actually committed the crime. The suspects are the Keebler elf, um, Mrs. Fields from Mrs. Fields Cookies, and Annie the rabbit from Annie's Organics. Forensic science is such an interesting field and everybody enjoys it. The girls in particular, they get excited about what to do in forensic science. They see it on crime shows and this gives them more uh, exposure to what happens in those crime shows and they often will tell me that they've done the crime shows so show things that have been done incorrectly and um, they were able to analyze the uh, evidence much better than what they see on the crime shows. Look at, because um, they'll, they'll look at hair analysis on a crime show and they'll, the person looking at the hair will say, oh, this is a match. And that's never what you say. You say that it has characteristics that are similar, but you never say that it's a match because that can mislead the jurors to convict somebody that should not be convicted. monster was blackmailed by whoever murderer was in here and showed him the note of the together forever and somehow stabbed him and then he didn't tell the murderer cookie monster and somehow stabbed him in the chest with a knife and then in the head. Um, the confession tapes. Remember the show I told you that Natalie and yeah. I watched? Yeah. We were watching the confession tapes and there was an eyewitness that said that they saw the suspect at the location where the crime took place, but she was mad at him because he would not let her take half of the money of a check because it was forged. So she was mad at him and she made up what she had told the police. Suspect number two and suspect number three. There is a slide here for a sample of the hair 
from the crime scene. So that's what you'll put on this side. There's nothing on here because you will analyze that and you will prepare this slide. So those that stay behind to do the analysis, that's what you will be doing. On the suspect sheet, there are fingerprints of the suspects. And Natalie, you want to show them? Species elf. <laughs> and hair is white. His current residence is a tree. <laughs> I don't know which tree. Here's his bio. Ernie is an elf of simple means, a real milk and cookies kind of guy. In his spare time, he bakes cookies for his multi-billion dollar company, Keebler. Recently, the company has fallen on hard times due to the public's demand of higher quality ingredients and a general distrust of short people. <laughs> um, her hair is brown and she lives in California. Here's her bio. She's a self-made woman. She started from a small cookie baking operation in her garage and now she owns this big company. In recent years, she tried to stay out of the spotlight <clears throat> although she was recently spotted by the paparazzi and when they yelled Mrs. Fields, Mrs. Fields, she said it's Miss Fields now. <laughs> Annie is a bunny. Her birthday, she was born in 2001. She's nine inches tall. However, it is important to note that she does have a three foot jer <laughs> vertical jumping ability. <laughs> She's a rabbit. Her hair is gray. She lives in at Petco, where the pets go. <laughs> slides and then from the blood spatter you can look at things like height when we look when we did passive drops and parent drops and so forth you